Hello everyone! We are introducing a new version of Engine Alternativa 3D. Alternativa is a three-dimensional engine for Flash platform. For those who isn't familiar with Alternativa yet, we will explain first who may need it and what for. First of all, Engine Alternativa is necessary for everybody who has to do with creating Flash applications. No matter in which environment, Adobe Flash, Flash Builder or any other tool. Involving Alternativa in Flash content creation process allows developer to make high-quality and high-performance applications with true 3D. Such applications are run in browsers available for any Internet user who has Flash Player version 10 installed. Alternativa can be used for developing promo sites, three-dimensional games or any other applications using three-dimensionality. Alternativa is a library written in ActionScript version 3. To start working with it, it's enough to download it, save to your project's catalog, and add by a few mouse clicks. Version 7 has been developed to make developers' life easier. For this purpose, basic rules of work with three-dimensional objects in Alternativa have been created similar to the existing mechanisms of ActionScript 3. It will take those who are a bit familiar with ActionScript version 3 half an hour to run their first three-dimensional application using usual properties and methods. In addition to this, there is a common mouse event system in the world of Alternativa. During development of version 7, a lot of efforts have been made to increase performance and to make sorting correct. Sorting is a very complicated and important task in three-dimensional visualization. It's an algorithm which determines sequence to draw objects or their parts so that those that are closer to us are drawn over those that are farther. And if objects intersect, one has to divide them into fragments so that one part can be drawn above and the other behind the intersected object. We can have a look at the example of intersected objects on the screen. There can be a few sorting modes. In Alternativa, there is sorting by BSP and KD trees, by central points and other. Such a number of different algorithms are necessary because some are more resource intensive and carry out more difficult tasks, while the other's benefit is performance. A special debug system will help to choose an algorithm and at the same time reveal points most challenging for sorting. Performance of certain application depends on modal complexity that in the first place is measured in number of polygons. However, there is culling mechanism in Alternativa which disregards polygons not necessary at this moment. So, calculations include only those polygons that get into camera's field of view. At the present moment, Alternativa is able to visualize from 10 to 12,000 of polygons. In addition to culling system, there is a class of includers which can hide from calculation and visualization the polygons which get into camera's field of view, but there is no need of them. The system of so-called lots is made to save resources. It allows to use for one object a few models with different detail level. When camera comes to the object close enough, the system shows high poly model. When it moves away, it switches to low poly model. During visualization of objects with textures that contain small details patterns, more effect usually occurs. To deal with it, one can use an alternative MIP mapping effect. Alternativa might be also attractive for three-dimensional modellers and animators. It allows to load models in 3DS and Collada formats with a few lines in action script. Besides geometry, Collada format can store skeleton animation, which is supported by Alternativa as well. And the same bones can be used for interactive animation using ActionScript. Since Collada format is an extension of XML, it can be extended as well. Alternativa uses it, allowing to save advanced settings right in the Moodle's file. And now you can manage the settings right from 3D marks using special plugin. And finally, a few details about the architecture of application using Alternativa. It's not a big secret that all that we can see on the screen in Flash application must be included into Display Tree. All display object objects, like movie clips, are added to Display Tree using Add Child method. There is three dimensional world of Alternativa existing parallel to the flat Flash world. Creation of the three dimensional world starts by declaring a container. One can add objects to it by usual Add Child method. These can be primitives like cube, important models, and other containers with their coordinate system. Everything is the same way as with movie clips, but the worlds are parallel, so how do we connect them so that we could see three-dimensionality? For that exists class camera 3D. Objects of this type are 3D world members as well as primitives or models. 
Camera is also added to the container by addChild method, and its location can be controlled within space. This class has view property. In this property, there is an object, which is a subclass of flash originated display object. It is this object that can be added to display tree as any movie clip. Exactly to it, camera transmits what it sees. So simple it is.